You, you get me every time like that, drinking my Monday morning cup of joe, and I hope you're doing the same. This is Dave, and welcome back to another episode of Monday Morning Cup of Joe. And I'm often surprised by people who click on the, the uh, thumbnail for this particular topic, empathy. Why? Because it's everywhere. It's everywhere. It's done, been done a million times on so many different podcasts. Um, why is it so popular? Well, as a researcher, I look at all different types of uh, input or data. And I get, you know, I get Inc. Magazine, Fortune Magazine, Entrepreneur, you know, Business Today, um, Psychology, the psychology of empathy in the work environment. I uh, do research in neuroscience. There's a lot of areas of study and research. And empathy comes back again and again and again. Why? Well, because I don't know that we fully understand what empathy is. You know, we, we encapsulate it in this, well, you know, it's the ability to put yourself in another person's shoes. Yeah, that's a fair statement. It's an oversimplification. And, you know, I'm always thinking when I'm doing this research, I'm always wondering, you know, how come they don't teach this stuff in school? How come we don't learn what it means to be a human being in school? It just blows my mind. And then I take a look at you know, being a member of LinkedIn, I look at all the job postings. Not, not that I'm looking for a job, but I'm really curious as to what uh, some of the titles that companies come up with, you know, like, uh, you know, senior vice president of love, you know, or whatever. They all have their own little words or their phrases for a particular job position. But then I like to drill down and look at, what are the skill sets? What are the skill sets that these companies are looking for? And more and more frequently, the word empathy comes up. And I think that the driving reason for this is that we are organizations of people, right? Last week, I think, or was at least last week, I think, we were talking about your tribe, Right, your tribe, which which inserts the the dynamic of relationship in business, right? I mean, if you go to our website, you know, our our slogan is, you know, leadership is relationship. Business is about relationships. And we all know that I think intellectually, but do we understand what that really means and how it should drive our behavior? how we need to behave differently because we are in fact in relationship with other people. And so on Wednesdays after the coffee, I'm going to do a drill down on empathy, but empathy from the standpoint of not just a concept of putting ourselves in another person's shoes, but rather putting it into practice. What does it look like? How do you how do you do that? How do you create empathy? How do you how do you show empathy? And so often we get it confused with sympathy. Oh, I'm I'm so sorry that you feel that way. And it's it's almost patronizing, if not fully patronizing. And that doesn't make the other person feel better. It feels it can feel worse. So how do we navigate this ability to be empathetic and do it in a way that builds our relationships? A lot of stuff goes in there. Authenticity comes to mind. You know, there's so much to learn about empathy. And I hope that you will join me 
on Wednesday for after the coffee to do a drill down on empathy. And don't be afraid in this particular episode of Monday Morning Cup of Joe or any of the after the coffees is to offer your perspective. What do you, what is your experience with empathy? Look, we learn more when we share with each other and we gain a common understanding. This podcast does not operate in a vacuum. We really, really do want to know what you think and what your thoughts are around these things that oftentimes are nebulous to us. We understand it intellectually, but do we really understand it in a way that has meaning? So important. So it is Monday. I hope you have your cup of joe whatever warm libation that uh, gets your day started and i would like for you to think about empathy and join me on wednesday about the after the coffee podcast around this elusive butterfly of emotion empathy in the meantime as always lead well my friend Thank you.